Hi guys, Cash Brown back again. Hope you're having a fantastic day or night, depending on where you live. So, you may have seen this video already, and... Oh, it's about... Like, we know, you and I, we both know, that the left and, you know, people like them, um, they love to take something and turn it into something that it is not, um, as long as it fits their agenda. It's something they do, they love doing it. Um, and I don't think I have ever ever in my life seen a stretch like this like we know that they will take something and they'll they'll twist it and they'll they'll make it fit their narrative everything is transphobic everything is homophobic everything is racist but uh, look there are, i i'm really i'm literally struggling to find the words to describe this video clip so i think the best thing to do is probably to watch it um, and then we will laugh about it and, you know, I'll give my thoughts. Um, it is going to be an incredibly short video, but I do plan on making a couple of videos tonight. So hopefully you will forgive me. Um, but yeah, as we do, before we jump into the video, can I please ask that if you're not subscribed to the channel yet, please consider subscribing. Your support makes me making videos possible. Um, and I really appreciate it. There's also channel membership. So if you want to support the channel, support me making videos, that's an awesome way to do it. Um, we've got three tiers and a bunch of awesome perks. So if you do want to support the channel in that way, then that would be appreciated. Either way, I appreciate it a lot. Yeah, let's check, check this video out because, oh my gosh, it's... There are no words. There are no words. <laughs> you and I both know that you are capable of enjoying the rain and frolicking freely without filming it and then posting it to TikTok. Says the woman filming a video to post on TikTok. Okay. Now you've just co-signed, okay? You've just co-signed at least 3 million 8.5 by 11 front and back people who just go out of their way to disrespect and dismiss the boundaries that black creators have set and now you're one of those people so i guess my question would be why why would why is it so important to all of you to treat us like we don't matter okay so her question was why my question is, what? <laughs> what the heck? What is she talking about? And she said, like, why do you insist on treating us like we don't matter or something along those lines? And the thing is, she is treating her like she doesn't matter. Like, I'm an indigenous woman. I don't feel oppressed. I don't feel like a video of somebody walking in the rain is racist. Like, you are making yourself feel like you don't matter because you're projecting your own insecurities, you're projecting your own worldview onto everything you see. In that way, of course, everything is racist. When your outlook is racist and you think everything is racist, then literally everything within you see is racist. And this is a great example of that. The thing is, dude, these types of people have been screaming racism, screaming homophobia, screaming trans transphobia for the longest time. Every single thing is one of these things. And we know that they're ridiculous, but I'm not surprised that a video like this exists. But if, because of course not. When everything is racist, why would a walk in the park in the rain not be? So there was another video that she made where she basically um, doubled down on the first ridiculous video. And I went to try to find it. And funnily enough, gone, absolutely gone. Her TikTok account is now gone. She has made another one where she's not really doing much of anything on it. Um, people are still just giving her so much crap in the comments though. Um, but yeah, she deleted the second video. But, you know, just imagine what she said and it's probably right. She was doubling down. And the thing is, right, I've noticed that a lot of creators haven't actually talked about what she's talking about, why she thinks this is racism. And of course, it's ridiculous. It's just some woman trying to get attention thinking that racism is in everything and what she's actually referring to there was this 
trend. It, it didn't really pick up a lot of traction, but there was this trend um, that was going around a little while ago where black creators would frolic in the rain um, as like a, I'm frolicking, not frolic in the rain, frolic in like the fields and stuff. Um, as in like, I'm frolicking and I, I don't want to get shot. But it, it was just, I don't know, it, it was just a, a thing that black creators were doing. Um, and she has really, really stretched and tried to make Drew's video, because this is Drew Barrymore, obviously, I didn't mention that, I don't think. Tried to make Drew's video cultural appropriation. And the thing is, like, Drew Barrymore is not frolicking in the field. She's not frolicking in the rain. She's just walking in the rain, like, she's enjoying her life. But, like, I feel like to try to put any kind of reasoning to this kind of thing or try to make sense of it is just you're just wasting time it was a bad take by a woman who clearly realizes that she mucked up even black creators who usually do buy into all of this everything is racism kind of thing even they're like no this is stupid so yeah i think she realized that it was it was a bad take it was a stupid video to make it was a stretch if you're being generous but I really wanted to show you guys this because, um, like, it's just funny. Like, this is one of those less serious videos. Like, it, it's, she wants it to be serious. Um, she was trying to be very serious and she was trying to, um, I, I don't know, kick up a fuss, um, and trying to get people riled up. But it, what happened was it just ended up being a funny video. Everybody is making fun of it. Um, and like, I, I never want anybody to like cop crap on the internet right like that's not nice I, I don't want anybody to get like cyber bullied but at the same time like when you say stupid things and people come after you for saying stupid things I, I feel like it's a little bit deserved but I did want to show you guys that because I think it's hilarious let me know what you guys think in the comments down below um I am going to try to make another video tonight so hopefully um there'll be another video up soon Otherwise, you guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you're not subscribed to the channel yet, please consider subscribing. Um, we do have channel memberships, so if you do want to join the channel, um, that would be greatly appreciated. I would appreciate your support either way. Otherwise, you guys, thank you so much for watching this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.